Hi, I am Dr. Kaz Dimantis here at Premier Dental Center, just two blocks east of Naperville North High School on Ogden Avenue in beautiful Naperville, Illinois. Some of my patients with dental problems ask me why they should hold on to their teeth instead of just getting a new set of dentures. Let's first talk about what dentures are. Dentures are dental replacements that have a base made of plastic and ceramic or plastic teeth that are inserted into the plastic. When a person has a full denture, there are usually no teeth left in the mouth. Patients that wear dentures can only bite with about 15 to 5% of the force of someone with all of their teeth. That means they've lost 95% of their efficiency. Some patients that have an exaggerated gag reflex cannot wear dentures because the upper denture usually covers the entire palate, which makes many people gag. Food does not taste as good because many of the taste buds are located on the palate and are covered up by the plastic. Patients usually have to severely modify their diet because the dentures wobble around on the gum tissue if harder food is bitten. No more steak or good, tasty, crispy French bread for you. Small seeds like sesame or poppy seeds can get stuck under the dentures and cause significant irritation and often a socially embarrassing situation. Many patients need dentures because they lost their teeth due to gum disease or periodontitis. These patients may have an extremely difficult time to hold on to the dentures in their mouths because of the extensive bone loss due to the periodontitis. The more bone a patient has left in the jaw usually makes it a little easier for the dentures to stay stable. A significant problem for patients with full dentures is that the bone that supports the denture is slowly lost over time until there is sometimes not enough bone left to hold the denture in the mouth. Probably everyone has seen older people with very poor fitting dentures or just people with no teeth. The facial appearance is quite unattractive because the face looks like it has collapsed. Some people try to glue the dentures down to the gums with dental adhesives like polygrip. This glue has to be applied several times a day because the glue leaks out from under the denture and the patient ends up swallowing the glue. Can you imagine what that glue does to the insides from swallowing this goop on a daily basis? Ugh. Certainly not very appealing. Patients that have severe periodontitis or have worn dentures for a long time may not even be able to have dental implants without needing bone grafting to rebuild the bone. The process of bone grafting can be complex, painful, and very costly. We already spoke of the potential embarrassing situation of seeds stuck under the dentures, but dentures also have to be taken out at night and placed in a container of water. This alone can make some people cringe at the thought of, making, of taking out their teeth every night in front of their spouse. For some people, dentures may be the only alternative and may be useful for some. The moral of the story is this. You should try to hold on to your existing teeth if your dentist can make the situation stable. Full dentures are a treatment of last resort. Regular dental visits and good oral hygiene will help you keep your teeth for a lifetime. You do not need to be the person who believes that a denture will take care of their problems and then find out too late that they cannot wear dentures. There are some very tragic cases with some very upset pe people. There is no other branch of medicine that is as preventive as dentistry. Just about all dental problems can be pre prevented with proper care and knowledge. I hope this video has been of value to you. We have other informative videos at the site below or just give us a call at the number below. We look forward to hearing from you. Goodbye.